In this video, I'll show you how to view scans and review scans in your Twinda Manager. To get to this page, simply log into the Twinda Manager, go to the upper nav bar, view scans, and click view scans. Once the page is loaded, you'll see scans that you've run on your scanner show up in the table below. On this table, you have a number of pieces of information about each scan. The ID number on the left corresponds with the part number for prints. The scan ID corresponds to the scan ID shown on your scanner when you run a scan. The customer name and email address refer to the customer name and email that were entered when the scan was run. The scan time is associated with the time that your scan was run. Once a preview has processed, you'll see a GIF image show up. If you put a comment in on your scanning dashboard, it'll show up here in the comment field. If there are any current orders that have this scan in them, you'll find links underneath current orders. In the cloud processing column, you'll see models that have been processed using the cloud. Those models will show up in green. For this model, both a preview and a print quality model have been processed. Under photo sets uploaded, you'll find which photo sets are currently available for processing. Here you can see that both a preview photo set and a print photo set have been uploaded for cloud processing. Under actions, you have the opportunity to request print quality downloads, reprocess previews, resend customer emails, update pricing and sizing to the current settings for your account, and review the scan. Also, under email, you can change the account that this scan is associated with. Here, we'll go ahead and review a scan. On this page, you'll be able to review a number of different things. On the far left, you can see the customer GIF. This is what is displayed in your customer's account. Immediately to the right, you'll see print heat maps. These will show you details about what parts of your model may be too thin to print at a variety of sizes. And on the right, you can see both a 3D model for texture review and a 3D model for mesh review. Here, you can decide to go full screen with either of these.